Let's see the key differences between systematic risk and unsystematic risk. Systematic risk is the possibility of loss associated with the whole market or market segment. On the other hand, unsystematic risk is the risk associated with a particular industry or security. Systematic risk is uncontrollable, but unsystematic risk is controllable. Systematic risk arises due to macroeconomic factors and unsystematic risk arises due to microeconomic factors. This risk affects a large number of securities in the market and this risk affects securities of a particular company. This risk means systematic risk cannot be minimized or controlled. So we can say that systematic risk is undiversifiable risk. Unsystematic risk, on the other hand, can be eliminated through portfolio diversification. So we can say that unsystematic risk is diversifiable risk. Systematic risk is divided into three categories. Interest risk, market risk, and purchasing power risk. Unsystematic risk is divided into two broad categories. Business risk and financial risk. So from these key differences, we can identify what is systematic risk and what is unsystematic risk. So systematic risk can be defined as a type of total risk that arises as a result of various external factors such as political factors, economic factors, soci sociological factors. Systematic risk is non-diversifiable in nature. This means that this type of total risk cannot be controlled or minimized or avoided by the management of an organization. A systematic risk has the tendency to disrupt not only, not just the whole of the market but an economy too. The major sources of systematic risk are risks related to, mar to the market, purchasing power and interest rate. And the common examples of such type of risk are inflation, price movements, fluctuation in interest rates, a rise in unemployment, etc. On the other hand, unsystematic risk can be defined as a type of total risk that arises as a result of various internal factors taking place within an organization. Unsystematic risks are diversifiable in nature. This means that these types of risk can be controlled, minimized, and even avoided, avoided by the management of an organization. Unsystematic risk has the tendency to disrupt the well-being of an organization and sometimes the industry too. The major sources of such risk are risk pertaining to finances, business and insolvency and the common example of the same are a higher rate of operational costs, a rise in labor turnover etc. So this is all about systematic risk and unsystematic risk. Thank you for watching this video. Please do subscribe my channel and hit the like button. Thank you.